One of Prince Harry's former flings is opening up on a short-lived relationship with the Duke of Sussex. Catherine Omini, who dated Harry briefly in 2006 when she was 34 years old and he was only 21 years old, admitted she had the time of her life with the prince. But there were times when he could be a bit childish. Catherine, a divorced mother of two, known for starring on The Real Housewives of DC, met Harry at a London bar in May 2006. The duo sparked a romance after the now 38-year-old asked her to hop in his Range Rover and go with him to an upscale nightclub, where he whisked her away to the club's VIP area. I started chatting to someone and Harry took the cloth out of the champagne bucket and put it over my head. She confessed of the younger man's shocking antics. I was a bit upset because it was freezing. I told him, stop being so needy, that's not the way to behave. Harry's security, who witnessed the playful prank, immediately stepped in and warned him against causing a scene. As Catherine recalled, they told him off saying, get a grip, you can't behave like that. The 50-year-old television personality added, I saw him get told off like that a few times. After claiming she needed to go home, Catherine said that the prince swept her up for a kiss by lifting her by her waist and holding her against the wall. Catherine said, he gave me the most incredible passionate kiss I've ever had in my life. I was absolutely speechless. Their fling only lasted a few dates after their initial meeting, but that was quite alright with Catherine, who explained, He was only 21, so a relationship was the furthest thing from my mind. The interior designer made the decision to talk publicly about a romance with Harry, following the news that he would be discussing some of his ex-girlfriends in his upcoming memoir, noting that she expected she wouldn't be included in the bombshell tell-all. Catherine said, We had some mutual friends in the property business and he introduced himself. Megan is going to be furious. She's insanely jealous, even of exes. According to Women's Day Australia, Megan has been keeping a jealous eye on Prince Harry's ex-girlfriend, Cressida Bonus. Cressida dumped Harry so she could be taken seriously as an actress and it's paying off. She's been scoring plum theatre roles and a lot of respect in London, which is something Megan always wanted to achieve but couldn't crack, the source said. It doesn't help that there's been no movement on her career even now she's back in LA. Every time Cressy gives an interview, Hinting that she chose a career over Harry, Meghan feels personally attacked, the source added. The tabloid also uploaded a side-by-side -side photo of Markle and Bonus taken on two different occasions. Since Markle is looking to her left and Bonus's photo is on the left side of the page, the tabloid included a cryptic caption. Meghan likes to keep Harry's exes in check, it read. Prince Harry and Bonus dated for a few years before they decided to call it quits. And according to royal author Katie Nichol, it was Bonus that wanted to end the relationship. In the book Harry, Life, Loss and Love, Nicol said that Bonus had a change of heart regarding a relationship after watching Prince William and Catherine's royal tour of Australia in 2014. Bonus allegedly realised that she didn't want the attention that is usually given to the members of the royal family. As such, she told Prince Harry that it's time to end things. The Duke of Sussex reportedly tried to convince Bonus to stay with him, and when she refused, Prince Harry was heartbroken. After all, his two girlfriends both didn't want to end up with him because he's a member of the royal family.